let's go over a few examples of our business rule editors. The first of these is our statement rule. Now this is a traditional if then else statement. The output of these rules can have a number of behavior types. Rules can output true or false. They can also output data such as a product number or a block of text. Rules can also be set up as scoring rules to calculate something like a credit score, for example. Additionally, rules can take action upon execution and kick off other workflows. Rules can be used as part of the workflow, creating branches, for example, or can sit alone and be called from outside decisions. The next rule editor is our truth table. Our truth table is the DMN, or decision modeling notation style rule, that can have multiple conditions and values, driving multiple outcomes. Next, one of our user favorites is our matrix rule editor. This rule will output the intersection of a row and column. You can even nest variables within rows or columns to create quite a complex rule table. Finally, our newest rule editor, which was introduced in version 7, is the rule table editor. This style rule allows you to define different rule verbs on the same piece of data for each specific row. All of these rules are configured in no-code graphical visual designers, allowing for a seamless, consistent user experience across the platform.